guys and welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to be trying out Candy Lips Lip Plumpers. They sent me two of these to try out for you guys. So if you're interested in seeing what I have to say about these lip plumpers and whether or not they work, you are in the right place. Just keep on watching. But before you do, please make sure you hit the subscribe button down below to join the family and make sure you hit that notification bell next to it so that you can get a notification every time I post a new video and you can come hang out with me. Without further ado, we're just going to jump right into the video. Okay. So, I got a package, and it was a really pretty package, it was, and it was from Candy Lips, and they sent me two of their lip plumpers. This is the first one, what it looks like, and this is the second one. It is super, super cute. It's an apple. Okay. And this one is the main one, and this is like a mini one that you can put in your purse to keep your lips plumped. And basically what you do, it comes with a silicone insert thing here so that it protects your mouth so that you don't get a ring around your mouth. And I don't know if you guys had seen in the past the Kylie Jenner challenge where people were like putting their mouth in a, um, putting their lips in a, shot glass and sucking them in so their lips got bigger they did work it worked but a lot of people like really injured their mouth and stuff and it was dangerous to do it that way so this is a clinically way to clinically proven way to plump your lips without damaging them as long as you do it the way that you're supposed to so they sent it to me in a cute little box and it has a candy lips extreme lip shaper set timer to where you can time yourself doing it and then it has a booklet with all the information on it and how to do it and um, how to clean it and if you only want to do one or if you only want to do both. Um, it shows you exactly what to do. See, it says to do your lips like this. Okay. And then you squeeze it. You want to make sure that this little thing, the kissy thing, is on the top. And then you squeeze it, put it on your mouth like this. And then you let it go and it suctions to your mouth. I can't do it right now because my lips are, um, I have lipstick on. And also I used it yesterday and it did bruise my lips a little bit which it does say in the package it can. I think I left it on a little bit too long. I was excited that I you know, kept doing it, kept doing it because I wanted to see how big they could get, which isn't a smart decision. You should always make sure you follow the directions precisely for stuff like this. Um, but I am going to insert pictures before and after yesterday when I used it so that you can see exactly what it did. Actually, you know what? I am going to try it because it's not really fair to the company for me to not try it on video. But just be forewarned that my lips are bruised. Okay, so as you can see, I just took it off. My lips are bruised here, here, and like right above this lip. But like I said, it's not the fault of the device. It's my fault because I didn't use it properly. It shows some pretty impressive before and after pictures in here. So that's pretty cool. So I have the little booklet and the little booklet clearly states, it says, um, caution before use, temporary hickey marks are likely to appear for seven days or less on the lips, around or inside the mouth on first time users. The discolorations may vary from light pink to bluish purple. This is a common side effect with continuous use of lip plumper daily, the hickey marks will not return. If you stop using the plumper for a few weeks and come back to the plump your lips again, the hickey marks may continue to come back. It is best to continue using the plumper for at least once daily. Some first time users may get a blood blister. In this case, wait until it heals completely before you plump again. If you change to a different size plumper, you may go through a conditioning period to adjust to a different suction strength. And it does show 
pictures of people with bruised lips here. So I guess maybe it wasn't because I used it too long. Maybe it's just something that happens. Shows what kind of a good listener I am, a reader. Okay, so I actually have really small lips, so I prefer to use the small one because when I use the big one, that's when I got the marks outside of my lips. Sorry, I have the stopper in here. They provide a stopper in case your one of your lips gets bigger than the other one and you just wanna work on one lip, there's a little stopper. So I have removed the bottom thing and then I put the little plastic thing back in here. Now I'm gonna scoot as close as I can so you guys can see, get you up close and personal with me. Okay. Hi. <laughs> Just kidding. Okay, so what we're going to do is we are going to press in and then like this and then put it on my lips. They got really purple. Oh my gosh. But they are definitely bigger. Hopefully the purple will go away soon. Let me get some concealer and put on it so it doesn't look so bad. I put way too much. <laughs> I don't want to get it on my mole. And then I'm just gonna take some L'Oreal Color Reach Matte Lipstick. Now, it does say that if you use this on a regular basis, 
that it will make your lips stay this way. But for, to start with, it's supposed to last a couple hours. Yesterday, it lasted about three to four hours for me, and which was really cool, because like I said, my biggest insecurity about myself is my lips being so small. So it's really cool to finally find something that works and actually makes my lips look legitimately bigger than what they are. So, um, yeah, that's pretty much all I had to tell you about these. Thank you to Candy Lips and Octoly for sending me these to try out in exchange for my honest opinion. I will leave a link down in the description box of this video so that you guys can click on it and check it out if you're interested in this product. And that's all I have for you guys today. I hope you've enjoyed this video and if you could please leave me a thumbs up on this video and let me know in the comment section down below what you think if you've tried this product or if you would be interested in trying this product and how you think I can improve this video in any way because I really 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 honestly and truly do value all of your opinions and I'm trying to make sure that I do everything that I can to try and make this channel the best that I can for you guys because you are awesome each and every one of you but without further ado if you haven't already please make sure you hit the subscribe button down below and hit the notification bell to join the family and get a notification every time I post a new video so you can come and hang out with me. And that's all. Thank you so much for joining me tonight. I will see you in my next video. Bye-bye, guys.